Hi everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, I am going to explain about the topic number systems. In this session, we are going to discussing about the concept of number of ways. Number of ways. How can you calculate number of ways for any number? Number of ways is nothing but basically how the question is asked is in how many ways you can represent, you can express the 24, for example, a small number 24 as a product of two factors, as a product of two factors. Suppose if you see this number, if I want to write 24 as a product of two factors, I can write this number as 1 into 24 or else 2 into 12 or else 3 into 8 or else 4 into 6. All these are called as number of ways. Now, how many ways are there for this uh, number 24? We can express the number 24 as a product of two factors in four ways. Four ways is the correct answer for this question. Here, if you observe carefully, the number 24 is very small number. That is the reason why we can directly write down all the number of ways. But for big, big numbers, it is definitely difficult task to find the number of ways. In order to avoid that, what we are going to do is, uh, first of all, I will tell you uh, how to calculate number of ways for big numbers uh, based on uh, what factors it will depend. Okay. Here, to solve the problems related to number of ways, uh, first, we must learn the number of factors. In the previous sessions, we already learned about uh, number of factors. Without knowing number of factors, it is not at all possible to solve the problems related to number of ways. So, why? Because uh, to calculate number of ways, uh, first, we will calculate number of factors. We must calculate number of factors. That is the first step. And then, again, it depends on two conditions. It depends on two conditions. One is, if number of factors are even. Number of factors are even. In case, if number of factors are even, then number of ways, number of ways is equal to Number of factors, number of factors plus 1 by 2. Number of factors, sorry, number of factors by 2. Number of factors by 2. Here, this is the first condition. In case, uh, if number of factors are even, then number of ways is equal to number of factors by 2. And the second condition is number of factors are even number of factors are even, sorry, odd. Number of factors are odd. Here the first condition is number of factors are even and the second condition is number of factors are odd. How can we calculate number of uh, ways if number of factors are odd? Again, in this case, uh, in this condition, we will be having two cases. One is as a product of two factors, one is as a product of two factors and the second one is as a product of, as a product of two different factors, as a product of two different factors. First, I will, exp I will write down the formula. After that, I will explain what is the difference between first case and Second case, as a product of two different factors. As a product of two different factors. That is the second case. Here, in second condition, in second condition, as the number of factors are odd, then number of ways is equal to. Number of ways is equal to number of factors, number of factors plus 1 by 2. Number of factors plus 1 by 2. As a product of two different factors, for this one, number of ways is equal to. Number of ways is equal to. 
number of factors number of factors minus 1 by 2 number of factors minus 1 by 2 now from this it is very clear that once again i am repeating the entire uh, number of ways concept uh, here basically number of ways uh, depends on number of factors whenever you are we are calculating number of ways first step is we must calculate number of factors if number of factors are even directly number of ways is equal to number of factors by 2 and then the second condition is in case number of factors are odd then again we'll be having two cases one is as a product of two factors and the another one is as a product of two different factors for first case number of ways is equal to number of factors plus 1 by 2 whereas for second case number of ways is equal to number of factors minus 1 by 2 now here if you observe carefully for this example for this example 24 number of factors here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 number of factors are 8 factors number of factors are 8 factors it indicates that if there are even number of factors then number of ways is equal to what number of factors by 2 here the number of factors are 8 divided by 2 will get number of ways as 4 if we write all the numbers as a product of two factors, we'll get a number of ways as 4. This is for first condition. Now, I will explain the example for second condition. Second condition, what is it? Number of factors are odd. Number of factors are odd. Here, in the last session, while we are discussing about number of factors, I told you people one point that for any perfect square, for any perfect square, number of factors, number of factors always odd. Number of factors are always odd. This point is very important. Always odd. Here, whenever we are going to calculate a, a number of ways for any perfect square, Always remember that is belongs to second condition. Number of factors are odd. Why? Because uh, for any perfect square, we'll get uh, number of factors are odd only. Then your answer is as a product of two factors or else uh, as a product of two different factors. This particular sentence will be mentioned in the given problem. Now I will tell you what is the difference between first case and second case. Let me take a small example for this one. See here. Small perfect square. 36. 36. I can write 36 as 1 into 36, 2 into 18, 3 into 12, 4 into 9, 6 into 6. 6 into 6. Now, if you observe carefully, total number of ways, how many ways? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But here if you observe carefully, we are having two cases. One is as a product of, as a product of two factors. This particular sentence will be mentioned in the given problem. And the second one is as a product of two different factors as a product of two different factors okay let me explain what is the difference between first case and second case here if you take number of factors for this number how many factors 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 total 9 factors total 9 factors number of factors are always odd that is 9 those numbers are, these are the numbers. These are the factors of 36. Factors of 36 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, 18, 36. Total 9 factors. Therefore, number of ways. If the question is asking about as a product of two factors, 
directly we can take number of factors plus 1 by 2. That is equal to 9 plus 1, 10, 10 by 2, 5. 5 ways. 5 ways is the answer. All those 5 ways are, these are the 5 different ways. 5 ways. These are the 5 ways. Sir. That is the answer for first question. Now coming to second question. What is that? As a product of two different factors. Sir. As a product of two different factors. Sir. Then the number of ways becomes 9 minus 1 by 2. Number of factors minus 1 by 2. Why it is minus 1 by 2? Because the reason is in this if you observe carefully as a product of two different factors. As a product of two different factors. But whereas in all the five possible ways, if you observe 6 into 6, last way, these two are same numbers. These two are same numbers. But according to the statement, that is two different factors. Because of that reason, we are excluding the last way. We are excluding the last way. So the number of ways, required number of ways are only Four. Because of that reason, we are subtracting 1 from second case and uh, we are adding 1 to the first case. That is a major difference between first case and second case. This is about uh, how to calculate uh, number of ways uh, of any number. Guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the session. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching.